again, it's a pleasure to have you with us here on Weekend Prime. Now, tonight, President Uru Kenyatta has condemned leaders who he says are obsessed with the 2022 succession politics at the expense of the country's development. The president says the continuing exchanges among leaders is creating unnecessary political tension, which is scaring away potential investors. Duncan Hamber begins our bulletin. <laughs> President Uhuru Kenyatta was here in Makadara constituency for the monthly Nairobi cleanup exercise. And here he chose to rid the country of what he called premature and toxic succession politics. Every time political tension which is unnecessary. Tunataka kuhakikisha wananchi wetu wako na chakula ya kutosha. Tunataka kuhakikisha na kwa bei ya nafu. Elected leaders were put on notice with the president saying the electorate is keenly watching. Wenzetu hatutakula via mavietu. Tutakula jasho ya viongozi wetu. Na yastahili sisi zote kama viongozi tuheshmiani. Ikija ni wakati wa maendeleo tuje pamoja. Nonetheless, host member of parliament, George Aladwa, a close ally of ODM leader Raila Odinga, dropped a referendum hint. Na raisu wewe, hakuna unastafu. Wengi wanasema utastafu 2022. Wengi wanasema intami yako ya mwisho. Sisi wa Kenya do tutasema. Kama utendelea, ama utendelea. This was the fourth monthly cleanup exercise for the county with the president issuing a warning to Muranga Governor Mwangi Wairia over the current water wars with his Nairobi counterpart. Tuwache siyasa ya maji. Maji ni kipeo cha mwenyezi mungu kwa wananchi wake. Na ile inatakikana ni sisi tuje pamoja, tujue, tutayatumia kwa njia gani kwa manufaa ya wananchi wa Kenya. Hii raslimali ni yetu sisi wote. It is my hope that residents associations, youth groups and women groups will in future take the lead in organizing this monthly event. The Nairobi Ward cleanup exercise was launched on July 7th. Duncan Hemba, KTN News.